Hi, I'm David Cantor with the Law Offices of David Michael Cantor. Today I'm going to talk about expungements or restoration of civil rights in Arizona. Now in Arizona there's actually, there's actually no expungements. What's it, what it's called is a judgment of guilt set aside. And that's actually the motion that we file. Now, um, on an application, if you have your judgment of guilt set aside and you fill out a, a job application and they say, have you ever been convicted for a crime? You can say yes. However, I had the judgment of guilt set aside and I no longer have a conviction on my record. Now a lot of employers look at that very favorably. They look at it that you either won on an appeal or it was expunged. Um, in regards to a motion to restore your civil rights, we normally file this along with the motion to set aside judgment of guilt because you want to get your voting rights back and that's very important. Uh, if you don't vote, if you're not registered to vote, there's only three reasons, dumb, lazy, or convicted. And we actually have a separate website by that name that'll tell you how to uh, register to vote. So once you get your civil rights restored, make sure you do that because I'm sure you have a lot to say about how this state is being run by our politicians. Now, in regard to firearms, you're not automatically allowed to carry a firearm just because we set aside your judgment of guilt. Certain types of crimes won't allow you to carry a firearm even if the judgment of guilt is set aside. You have to request that separately. So if you or a loved one are seeking to set aside a judgment of guilt or get an expungement, restore your civil rights or restore your right to carry a firearm, contact us for a free 30-minute consultation in our office. It doesn't cost you anything, but it does take about 30 minutes. We have multiple certified criminal law specialists. We'd love to help you out with it, and we look forward to hearing from you soon.